hear the voices of greatness on the World Wide Web. VG8 Radio, the voices of greatness. Something cool, something very nice to woo. Do you wanna hear Clary and talk? Do you wanna see Evie? So may we call on our co-host, Sir Rombel Aureliano. Hello, Sir Rombel. Yes. How are you? I'm good, Mami Glo. And uh, good evening yeah. po sa inyo lahat. Ating ngayong gabi, Mami Glo, ang isa sa ating uh, wow, uh, regular uh, host for season yes. 2. No? At uh, siya rin ay uh, mukhang na talagang every time mag-show tayo, she really look really uh, very gorgeous. Ladies and gentlemen, Miss Feli Ruelo. Hi, Ma'am Feli. Good evening. Hello. Good evening. You're on mute, Ma'am Feli. Nakamute ka, Ma'am. Yeah. Oh, I'm so go. sorry. For, uh, <laughs> <laughs> so again, thank you, Sir Romel, for for such a wonderful um greeting and uh, the those kind words about me. And Ma'am Iglo, also good evening. <laughs> and to everyone who is um, joining us right now. A wonderful evening to all of you. And speaking of which, our guest for tonight, ayan, let, uh, let's have Ma'am Feli, no, Ma'am Iglo, to introduce yes. our guest yes. for tonight. Take it away, Ma'am Fel. Ma'am Feli, please do the honor. Yes, Ma'am Iglo and Sir Romel. So our guest for tonight is, again, one of the wonderful ladies, especially in the... Uh, community of persons with disabilities who conquered the many challenges at a very young age due to cerebral cer cerebral sorry, sorry. oh my god cerebral cerebral cerebral, cerebral. cerebral. Oh, see, yes. but she never allowed her condition to hinder her from making a statement and doing what she wants so without any further ado let's get to know who she is as we watch this video I am Chris Esper Trinidad, 29 years old, from Nabunturan, Davao de Oro. I was born on October 27, 1992. My family calls me Ken Ken, and my friends call me Chris or Chrissy. I was diagnosed with cerebral palsy when I was 8 months old. Ever since I was a kid, I really love reading books, like fairy tales, fables, poems, and anything that is interesting to me. Being born with cerebral palsy makes you different, not just physically, but also emotionally. Growing up, I seldom go out and play with my cousins, even if they don't make me feel that I don't belong in the group. But sometimes, I still choose to stay at home and read my books, and after finish reading the whole story, that's when I start creating my own version of a happy ending. Being alone almost all the time gave me the reason to start creating stories inside my head. Yes, you heard it right. I only make stories inside my head instead of writing them in a notebook. But before you give your reactions, hear my reason first. As I've said, being born with cerebral palsy, everything is different and also tricky especially in terms of doing things like walking, talking, writing, and a lot of things you can think of. Creating stories inside my head is my favorite hobby ever since I started reading up until now. And my only way of creating stories is only through my mind because it made me happy even if I am alone. 
I studied elementary at Nabunturan Central Elementary School, high school at Nabunturan National Comprehensive High School, and in college at ACES Technical Institute of Nabunturan Foundation. Back when I was still young, I always felt envious of other people's life. Many questions were made inside my head. Why can't I walk? Why am I not beautiful? Why am I not rich? Too many whys, and I admit that there was a time when I hated God for His doing. I complain too much, and do not realize that I am still lucky despite having my disability. I can go to school, buy the things that I want, eat in a fancy restaurant, and go anywhere I want, but still, I didn't appreciate all the blessings that he has given me. I already have experienced all kinds of bullying, name it. I already know that I can never avoid this, but every time someone bullies me, I ask myself, do I deserve this kind of treatment from them? Did that make them happy, bullying me? But despite all the struggles I experienced, I survived my studies. Even if some of the teachers and other people doubted my skills and said that I am not the one answering my quizzes, assignments, and exams, but I proved them wrong and show them that I deserve all the recognition I get every awarding time. And I am proud to say that I am an honored student in high school and graduated with flying colors in college. I passed the NCIV exam for computer programming, NCIV, which is said to be a very difficult exam to pass. Fast forward to year 2018. That was the year when I got my first ever job as a graphic designer. I was very thankful to Miss Eva Pareno, the one behind volunteer PWD events for trusting me and hiring me as her virtual assistant or graphic designer. I have been working for her for three years, and whenever we don't have projects, I do freelance graphic designing. If someone wants to have their own logo, store signage, birthday banner, etc. Present, I am currently studying at CVAP, and I am really thankful to Miss Gloria Antwerfia for introducing me to this program and giving me scholarship. As someone who was born with cerebral palsy, talking is a struggle every time. But because of CVAP, I can feel that my speech problem is kind of changing a little. And my confidence in talking in front of the camera got better. It actually helps me in my vlog. I have a YouTube channel called Chris the Voice Blogger, where I share my life as a cerebral palsy warrior and hope to inspire my co-PWD to do things that we think that is impossible for us to do because of our disability. As the voice master said, someone out there needs to hear your voice. That is why I'm using my YouTube channel to voice out my feelings and opinions and to let people know that I, a PWD, have something to show the world despite of our disabilities. I hope that with my story, someone out there will be inspired and be brave enough to try things that they are afraid to try. Yay! Hi, Chris! Welcome! Yay, Hi! Welcome to our show! Ganda naman ni Chris! Yes, very beautiful. Hello, bagong lahat, Chris! Batu! Batiin, yes, batiin mo ang lahat ng ating mga viewers for tonight all over the world. Okay, sige. Hello po, good evening sa lahat. I'm Christopher Trindel from Nubuntu ng Dabaw de Oro. Ayan. O batiin mo yung mga taga-dabaw sa dialect. Sa dialect, yes. Batiin mo yung mga taga-dabaw sa dialect ninyo. Ma Mayong gabi sa tanan. Mayong gabi. Wow. 
Oh, Ang cute. <laughs> Mayong gabi. Sa inyo tanan. Yan. Parang hindi bagay. <laughs> Mayong gabi. Sa inyo tanan. So, uh, welcome din eh sa ating uh, programa. The Voice of PWD. Ayan, nakauban na ito na karong gabi. Gabi eh, si uh, Chris Esper. Hello. Hello. <laughs> Bagay pa sa akin. Oh, Ayan. <laughs> Nagka, nagkasundo. Yes. <laughs> nagkasundo, binibenta kami. <laughs> Ayan. Yeah, Ayan. Chris, we are so happy to have you tonight. Uh, At um, uh, we are really inspired, you know, by by uh, by your life, you know. Itong, Uh, the, the first time that I saw your story, I heard your story, was the last Saturday, you know. And uh, we are so amazed for you to uh, to share your um, your, your own. I, I think that's that's uh, your own story, you know. Uh, tungkol sa sa nambuli sa yon, you know. And we, uh, natatcha ko personally don sa nambuli sa yon, no. Because yeah, every one of us. Uh, Uh, have experienced how is it to yes, be Yes, so walang ano, walang um, hindi nakaranas niyan sa atin. Yes, and for your information, Chris, we are, we are all here. Uh, Mami Glo, myself, and Mam Feli is a PWD just like yeah. you, ano? And um, yun, pare-pareho kami ng, dep- ng, uh, ng uh, disability. Uh, we have uh, um, uh, orthop- orthopedic, yes. Uh, Mami Feli and I orthopedic. and uh, Mami Glo. Or orthopedic uh, we we are we had this polio no so yes ayan so nak- nakikiisa kami na sa iyong uh, nararamdaman you know, during that time at talaga namang uh, oh, relate na relate kami doon sa story na ibinahagi mo sa amin ano uh, doon sa PWD Got Talent uh, segment natin ano sa show natin I missed okay. that uh, kasi I was not there last Saturday. Yes, you were not there. But, but you know. don't worry. Don't worry, Miss. Don't worry, Feli, kasi dito ngayon is mas makikilala natin kung sino ba talaga si Chris Esper Trinidad. So, without further ado, let me ask this first question. Uh, warm ano lang to, ha? Warm. warm up question lang to, ano, Chris. So, warm up question. Okay. Whose character in a film or book or in a book that you would like yourself to become and why? Si Ariel Bodan, The Little Mermaid. Wow. Ah. Oh. <laughs> favorite nun. Why? Yeah. Why? <laughs> Very uh, determined siya, no? Na to, to, to siguro to live her life independently. Siguro just like All of us naman, di ba? We struggle. Uh, I mean, we find ways na ma-enjoy yung kabat ng lalo na ng bata tayo, di ba? Mm-hmm. Correct. Mm-hmm. Yun. Ariel, um, The Little Mermaid. Bata. Yeah. Uh, Ariel. Ako gusto ko doon si, ano eh, si Superman eh. <laughs> oh, wow. Gusto ko doon maging wow. Superman. Wow, Superman. Gusto ko yan. Yes. I, I, Siyem- I would do it. Siyempre kung ako naman ang tatanungin mo, Yes, mm. Sir Romel. Sir Romel, kung ako naman dadat, ang tatanay mo, gusto ka ako si Darna. <laughs> Yun? Very local, ano? no? Pinoy na Pinoy. <laughs> yes, very. Oo, oh, 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 gusto ko yung local talaga. <laughs> Ma'am Feli. Ikaw, Miss Feli, kung ikaw ang papipiliin, sino gusto mo? Sino, sino naman ang pipiliin mo? I be Elsa? <laughs> El- Elsa. Elsa. Do you like to build a snowman? Yes. Si Elsa. Ano nga yun, sir? Uh-huh. Nga natin yan. <laughs> Would you like to ask me why? <laughs> Would you like diba? to tell us why? A why? Yeah. Miss Perry. Why? British ba yun? Because uh-huh. as you know, I am loving. Why? <laughs> At the same time, brave. 
Uh-huh. Loving because I'm always yes. getting careful with my actions and words towards others. Char. <laughs> <laughs> Char. Right. Oh, tanungin niyo, tanungin niyo rin ako bakit bakit naman Darna? Bakit naman Darna? Oh, bakit ang Darna? Ko. Bakit Darna? Bakit? Oo. Bakit? Kasi kagaya ng ginagawa ko ngayon ay uh, tumutulong ako sa mga nangangailangan at kahit hindi sila nangangailangan, eto pag nakita nakita ko na na itong taong to is behind behind dun sa kanyang behind her back or behind his back, meron siyang longing, meron siyang kailangan. So, I usually ask them, ma- ma- ano, po yung, ano po yung ibang concern ninyo? O, oh, di ba? So, ganun tayo. So, so kaya, so kaya si Darna talagang Darna. always on the go. At saka, meron malakas ang senses niya na pinalalaman niya kung itong, itong lugar na to, meron, meron na akong na, meron na akong nararamdamang problema dito. Pupuntahan ko yan. O, lilipad na ako. Wish ko lang makalipad ako. Yan, di ba? Oh, But I can use my I can use my leg, I can use my crutches to go anywhere, everywhere. So at this point in time, I, my, can I ask Sir Romel, bakit naman si sino ba yung napili mo? Ba- at bakit? Superman. Si so, Superman at bakit? Yeah, I, I want to be Superman because I always want to be there for everybody. Oh. Wow. <laughs> Wow. Sana all. <laughs> Sana all, di ba, Chris? Because not all okay. heroes wear capes. Capes, diba? yes, indeed. Uh-oh. Yes. Chris, kaya namin natanong yan kasi uh, we we heard uh, that narinig namin kanina that you love making stories in your mind, you know? I'm just a bit curious. I just, yes, uh, I just want yes. to know. My second question pa tayo actually, you know. Uh, actually, the second question is uh, telling about yourself. Ano? Pero uh, busog na kami kanina doon sa introduction video pa lang natin talaga. Yes, naman. Oo, na skip. Oo, nalaman na namin talaga kung sino siya. But I, I wanted to know, no? I wanted to, uh, cu- uh, curious lang ako. What did you do with the stories in your mind? Are you writing it down? Or are you trying to share it with other people? Please. Um, nag-start ako ng school at yun yung after high school ko. Pero mas nasulat ni Jeremy ko sa Wattwards. Ah, okay. Yun po. Uh, so, yung stories in your mind, uh, isinusulat mo siya? Opo. Nag-start ako mag-sulat um, nung ano, after high school. For that in elementary, um, hindi. Hindi pa ako magsusulat kasi. Mahirap ko magsulat ah. eh. So, nasagot ako ng lahat. Ah, ah talaga. Wow. So, Chris, so, nasa, nasa, ko? nasa, ano mo lang. Nasa, nasa isip mo lang. Na. Instead of writing mm-hmm. it, oh yes, instead of writing it in a notebook. Actually, no? mamig lo, ano. Yeah, so, so you have given the chance, no? Oo. Oh, oh. Oh, she's now writing. Yeah, she's now story. writing at oh. ang dami. Yeah, she at talagang na-share niya sa akin yung mga yung mga ano niya, mga poems niya, no, mga tula niya. At talaga naman talaga. nakaka-inspired, nakaka-inspired na. Oh, galing naman. Uh, dito, dito mo siya, dito mo siya mas makikilala kung sino ba talaga si Chris. Despite the disability, mm. she's a very strong woman. Diba, yes. no? oh, and very talented. I can say that she's 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 very very talented. Napakalawak na napakataba ng kanyang utak. Ang dami ang dami laman ng utak niya puno puno. No? Oo kaya yes yeah, so oh, so okay. Oo i ano mo yan? I practice mo talaga. Do it. Um, yes. Oh oh more practice and yes. May talent ka. Yes, at yung at yung kanyang pag-join ng SIVAP is a blessing. Is a blessing kasi malaki ang naitulong ng SIVAP sa kanya to, to boost her confidence. And uh, sige, hindi nag-jump na tayo dun sa question number two. So ito yung follow-up question po sa question ni Sir Romel, no? Na, na, instead, na, na, yung, na instead of writing in a notebook yung iyong mga, mga stories na 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 na, 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 na parang inanatili lang siya sa sa ano sa sa head mo but yes. as you age 
nagkaroon ka ng initiative at nagkaroon ka ng ano ng ng ano talaga ng nag-decide na talaga na desire na magsulat na talaga no at talaga na mayroon kang vlog mayroon kang vlog so can you tell us kasi ito yung ito yung naging isang paraan isang naging tool upang mabus yung confidence mo magkaroon ka ng ng confidence na humarap sa in public no sino man ang kaharap mo is kaya mo na silang harapin can you tell okay. us what sibap change your life as a person and as a CP, a person with cerebral palsy? Um, never talagang inisit na mag-dub. Kasi ako, ano, hindi ko, hindi ko gusto yung boses ko kasi parang feeling ko hindi, hindi may isi din ang tao, malalita ko kasi ka, Um, nahihirap ako magsalita. Pero dahil na si Bob, nabush talaga. Kailangan ko mag-record. Kailangan ko magsalita all the time too. Dahil na si Bob, yay. May confidence na lang ako mag-ganyan. Maging ba? Maging talkative. Yung ba? Yes, yes. Ang galing. Oo, okay, practice mo. Oo, oo, oo. Just need practice, di ba? Practice makes perfect. So, always yes, you have to ano, like, express yourself. Whatever Actually, you have in your mind. Mm, just correct. Say it, express it. Lalo Actually, Oh, you're doing a great job, no, actually. Kasi ikaw lang ang nagboses kanina ng introduction video mo, no? Uh, the way you... you I, I hear your Christian, voice, no? Christian, oh, uh, if, if, mm, if somebody would hear it, no? Without seeing you, who would have imagined, no? Na ang nagboboses pa lang sa likod na yun is a PWD, no? Uh, talagang, uh, indeed, tama, ano, uh, Chris, uh, the world really needs to hear your voice, no? So, yeah. ang, ang galing ng, ano, ng transformation, from being a shy type na hindi mo kaya magsalita pero when with the CVAP nung uh, nandito ka sa CVAP ayun na improve ang voice mo ang ganda ng audio niya i should say and i should admire na ang ganda ng audio mo Chris kaya uh, i i believe that you will have a long way to go no uh, sa yung talent na yan ano just just continue to keep it up and de- develop it even more ikaw yung nag ano no nagsulat ng script mo na voice over ni Crystal tama. Yes. Sir. Ikaw yung nag nag-compose noon. Wow. Ang galing, oh, diba? Ah. Siya yung nag ano noon. Tapos si Crystal ano credits to oh, um Crystal Trinidad sir. Siya ang nag uh, voice over. Ah, okay. Over. Ah, siya yes, pa nag voice over. Oo, oh, oo. Oh, oh. Si Miss Crystal tapos si oh, oh. si ang nagsulat ng script si Chris. Oh, oh. That's a, a very good yes. writing. Oh, I'm sorry. I si thought Chris it was Chow you. Really and that, voice no. over. Okay, sabi kong galing ng boses, no? But anyway, uh, voices, uh, hindi lang siya si, doon sa... Pero si Chris, si Chris ang nag... Si Chris ang uh, kanyang content. Yes. Yes. Oh. yes. Uh, don't worry. So, hindi lang doon uh, sa audio. Mm. Hindi lang naririnig ang boses. Kundi na sa pagsulat yes. din. That's yes, uh, yun na eh. on how you communicate no, with other people. That is considered as a voice. And you're doing a great job. Yes, Sana eh. one of the days makabasa ako ng isa sa mga sinulat mong aklat. Kasi iniisip ko, yes. sobrang dami ng, mm-hmm. ng istorya sa head ko. Siguro marami ka na rin na isulat ng mga libro. Ano? Gusto ko nga itanong sa Romel, ano kanya yung mga stories na yon? Is it about yeah, fantasy? Eh. Is it about real life stories ba yan? Ano kayo? Yeah. Ano? Sige sir. And, 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 I yes. was, and I was curious. Uh, yes, how, how Chris. Uh, gumagawa siya ng sariling yes, ending. Yes, ano? Chris. I-share mo kay I-share mo sa I-share mo kay Sir Romel yung inyong ano yung yung link ha sa sa YouTube mo, okay, sa YouTube bro. channel mo kasi maraming okay, story bro. doon. Yes. Okay, Romel. <laughs> okay, so Chris, um this is well, we now go down to uh, one of the questions here ano. So, not a lot of people could really understand, you know, kung, kung, uh, your, your actions or your, your actuations, you know. And uh, not everyone can, uh, you know, can, can, can grasp that understanding that there is, um, what you're doing is not just, uh, sabihan natin, parang umaarte lang or something, di ba? So, this is a special condition, right, right Chris? 
And that is yes, called cerebral, uh, yeah, cerebral palsy. You've mentioned earlier yes, in, during our introduction that you have this uh, cerebral palsy. Now, what is cerebral palsy? Uh, in your own definition, Chris, ano, uh, what is cerebral palsy and how does it affect your daily life? Um, cerebral palsy is major, may, hindi ka nakaka, uh, may problema sa pagalaw mo, hindi ka nakaka-balance. Tapos yung iba naman, nahihiyaban mo salita. Yun po. Mm-hmm. Hindi mm-hmm. nakokontrol yung movements, kumbaga yes. Sir Romel, no? Mm-hmm. Ano daw po ang, ano, ang cause, nag-cause nung ano na to, ng, ng illness, or nung ano na to, disability, I mean, from ano ba, since birth ba yan? Para, ano sabi ng doktor? Um, okay. Sabi po ng doktor, um, na-delay po yung bukasok ng oxygen sa utak ko. Kaya po, mm-hmm. nagkaroon ng... Hindi na ako so, ba so na mm-hmm. Hindi agad hindi na ako, nadalas na doktor? Um, hindi po ako. Hindi po daw. Nakalabas agad. Baan na ako ba? Mm-hmm. Yes, uh, it is a condition ano, that has a, something to do with uh, sa functions ng brain. Ano? So that's why uh, yeah, we have this, uh, he has this uh, uncontrollable movement ano, because uh, some part of the uh, brain, uh, hemispheres of the brain uh, are affected, ano, yung kanyang movement. So that's the reason why. Ano. And, and how, how do you, how, how, how was the struggle? Paano anong struggle niya na ina-encounter mo every day, uh, uh, Chris? What are the struggles that you encounter? Kasi um, maraming bagay na hindi ko. Hindi ko kaya gawin na ako na, like, kunwari, mm-hmm. gutom ako. Gusto ko magluto pa, hindi ko magawa. So I have to ask someone to cook for me. Ito. Uh-huh. Oh, kaya, oh. gusto ko na so, hindi naman pwede ko din yung hindi ako makalaka na ako lang. So, I need to ask mm-hmm. someone again. Yung po. Yung po talaga yung pinakamahirap sa part ko. Mm-hmm. Oh, Pero so napanood then... napanood ko sa isang YouTube ano mo, um, uh, isang um, ano to, yung post sa YouTube na sabi mo ah, uh, nag nag nagsasa sumisikap ka talaga na magawa yung mga bagay na gusto mo kasi you don't want to rely with other people parang ganon yeah. opo mm-hmm. kung kaya ka kaya nito yeah so you always aim for independence no kasi it feels ano naman talaga sir Romel de ba mami ko no? fulfilling yeah. para sa atin na nakakagawa tayo ng mga bagay-bagay na nagagawa ng mga yes, physical so, uh, ng mga tao. Uh, uh, Kasi uh, pick up natin yun. Uh, uh, It's just that. Uh, seven, seven, uh, uh, seven times now ng effort ng ina-exert natin as compared to the uh, physically normal people. So, yes. kung pagka tayo special, yes, special so, uh, 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 At uh, ang, de, ang ano dito, ang, nakaka, ang nakakatuwa dito is pagka nakikita nila tayo, na na na, na ano ba na, ako like for example ako pag na, nakikita nila akong naglalakad o umaakyat sa hagdan nahihirapan sila sa akin so usually ang ano sa ang ang reaction sa akin ng mga tao is kanak uh, you need help uh, ano tulong po magagawa namin sa iyo gusto mo tulungan ka namin yung ganun sila so ang ano ko naman is kasi nakikita nila na nahihirapan ako. Pero sabi ko po, hindi po ako nahihirapan. Ano lang po, uh, challenge po sa amin ito. Pero kaya naman po. Kasi, pero, uh, yung bang... Oo, oh, oh. oh, 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 really. People's health. Yes, yeah, I really naman, appreciate. Oo, oo, oo. Pero it's good na that people always ask on how they could help us. Di ba? Yes. Kasi for example... Yes, uh, Um, ako naranasan ko yan eh, na they didn't ask that uh, they wanted to help. So, when I was um, pushing the door, ganyan, so grabe ang effort ko, di ba ganun? Tapos, 
hindi nagsalita <laughs> yung gusto akong tulungan. Sito, instead na matutulungan ako, na-dive tuloy ako kasi bigla nilang, alam mo, andun na yung yung force ko sa door, <laughs> yung hand ko. So, tinutulungan. Tapos biglang hinatak, ano? Ah, oo, oo. Oh, oh, oh. na, wait, you need help. I'll be the one to push the door. Oo, oh, oh. so, so, so pinupush mo na, pinush nila, so nag-dive ka. So, oh, yun yung, so, so oo, oh, oh. so, yun yung tendency na dapat before before na bif, pag nag-ask sila ng ano nang nagtanong sila sa iyo antayin nila yung sagot oh, antay antayin nila yung sagot para hindi o oh, o oh, o oh, o oh. yun ang yun ang ano doon yun ang dapat yun ang tama doon na antayin ka nilang sumagot muna hindi yung nagtanong nga tapos bigla kang tinulungan na, na instead na nakatulong na pasa Yeah, oh, unintentional kasi hindi nga hindi, hindi nga nila. Hindi nila intention to hurt or something. Kaya lang hindi uh, nila. Uh, unintentional. Un, yes, That's unintentional yung ginawa to, nila. That's why we are here to to para ikla it clear. Yes, okay, for awareness, 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 exactly. information oh, at the same time na educate na educate natin ang mga ang <laughs> mga katulad natin mga person with disabilities at lalo na yung mga mga ano mga able body na nakakasalamuhan natin every day. Alam niya ba yeah. nung nasa ano kami ha for a while uh, uh, Chris no kasi as uh, speaking of ano yung mobility natin no na yung na, alam mo ba na nakakwentuhan namin with the ABS-CBN uh, production team yung yung guard na nag-assist sa amin throughout doon sa LRT2 na sabi nila may, may mga mga encounter sila ng mga persons with disabilities na pag nagtanong sila ano po maitutulong namin ano kaila ano pong kailangan niyo po ng tulong pero ang ang feeling daw nung tinanungan nila is na discriminate sila binuli sila ang alam mo ba ang instant na tanong na sagot daw sa kanila doon sa guardia ang sagot daw hindi kaya kaya ko hindi ko kailangan ng tulong sabi daw nung ano nung nung, nung person with disability so na ano sila yung bang naging lesson sa kanila na aantayin nilang mag seek ng help yung yung person with disability para tulungan nila pero pag hindi daw nag 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 ano nag ask ng help si person with disability papanoorin lamang daw sila. So sabi ko, siguro po, binsan po pag ganun, mag-initiate pa rin po kayo. And first and foremost, sa amin din mismo na person with disability, ang initiative na kagaya ko, Sir, can you do me a favor? Can you provide a wheelchair for me? Kasi mag magkukross ako na from LRT2 going to LRT1. It it will take 10 minutes to to walk to walk that ano that uh, that aisle. Going to cross the ano to cross that that uh, long way going to LRT one. So ano? Sabi nga nila ah, yun po ang inaantay namin yung humingi kayo ng tulong sa amin. Kasi pag kami po ang nag na naunang nagtanong, most of the time po akala na akala niyo din discriminate namin. So yun. So tayo po mag tayo po yung mag, mag unang mag-initiate para po hindi nila ma-feel na dinidiscriminate natin pag sila ang nagtanong at it so happen na hindi ko kailangan ng tulong. Kaya ko. Kaya ko. Manigyo, yung ganun daw na naman, Yes. Mga kapwa nating PWD, wag na sa ganun oh, oh, ano yung way ng pagsagot. Yes. Kasi wala alam naman so, Oh. Eh, 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 ano muna natin, i-assess i- muna natin kung talaga bang ang pagkasabi is na di, uh, parang iniinsulto ba tayo, niriridicule ba tayo or hindi. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Sure naman yung intention ng ako, tao na. As alam mo, ako very thankful ako pag gano'n, pag gano'n, very thankful naman ako. So, Chris, do, Chris, follow up do sa mga pinag-uusapan natin. Did you encounter this kind of situation sa uh, in may mang yung time na lumalabas ka ng bahay with your with your family nakaka-encounter ka ba ng ganito mga scenario Opo, yung sa akin kasi medyo ano one time bumunta ako ng mall tumitingin ako ng mga i think mga facial ano pampaganda titingnan okay so was <laughs> Pag-ibig na mag-ibig sa akin, ano, sis, lady. Okay. Ano, 
Mam, baka bigyan kang mag-well dito ah. Oo, oh, ha? Oh my God. Mam, oh. change mo. That's not mm-hmm. nice. Oo. Oh. Simon. Ang beses na yung mga... Oo. Ang beses ko na na-experience. Simon. Talaga. This is, ano, no? Mm-mm. So, so ano ang, ano, ano, ano ang, ano ang step na ginawa mo? Anong, anong ginawa mo nung sinabihan ka ng ganun? Um, nag-spell lang po ako. Sabi ko, um, hindi po, hindi po po ganun. Hindi yung sinabi ko. Oh. But, pero kung, kung hindi mo di talaga ako noon, gusto ko siya, gusto ko, nabuting na. <laughs> Wala ko siya naman din ang miss. Hindi naman bote. Hindi naman bote na naka-wager. Magwawala agad. Hindi naman kami baliw pa magwala. Oo. Sana sa mga nagdami sa atin ngayon, ano, it's, uh, ano, sana, sana matutod din yung mga, ano, na, na, na to, to treat people with disabilities like that, that way. Oh, na kasi they are hurting oh, hurt oh. people. Eh, you know na yes. ng strano oh, mga tao. Oh. Hirap niyang control yung muscles, yung movements niya, and then sasabihin mo nagwawala siya. So that's very, ano. Mm-hmm. Okay. Siguro na, that answers, uh, uh, oh, Chris, you know? Mami Glo and uh, Ma'am Feli, that answers our third question sa kanya, ano? Yung biggest challenge ka. <laughs> oh, oh, yes, yes. At yes. Mag-lead, mag-lead na rin doon sa, sa question na yun that how is she able to overcome ano, yung mga challenges na yun. Uh, being in that situation talaga, very challenging talaga. Ano? Gaya nga na nabanggit natin kanina, di ba Chris? If people will, yes, is not, uh, do not really understand your situation, gaya niya, no, di ba? O oh, baka magwala ka dito. Sa halip na mag-offer ng help, di ba? Nag-ano pa nang na... Oh, 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 misinformation oh, or... Oh, you, napaka-mean. Oh, And I think yeah. all of us have have been through the challenges, di ba, Chris? Oh, and and good yes, for yes. you. How, how do you... Oh, oh, I understand, ano? As, ano? I can feel you, eh. I understand it has an emotional effect, no? Sa iyo, emotionally. Kasi sabi mo kanina, kung, mag, kung magmamaldita ka na, sagot mo na, di ba? But you are not maldita, di ba? Pero deep inside yes. of you, it really hurts, right? It really hurts. Oh, oh. So, how do you oh, how do you deal with that hurt? Wala. How do you... Just mm. go, okay, fine. Kung ganyan, tingin niyo sa akin, okay, fine. Si Lord, nang bahala sa inyo. Basta alam po, hindi na wala akong baliw. Hindi ako magwapala sa buwan. Oo, tama yan. Yung magpapin mo, para hindi ka malungkot. Intindihan mo na... Right. Yes, yes. No. Sir Romel, Sir ah, uh, yes, Sir Romel, Feli and Chris, no. May marami ka mas sa, 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 sa society natin ngayon. Marami pa rin ang hin- mga able bodies na hindi nakakaalam kung ano ba yung kung ano ba what is cerebral palsy. Kaya pag nakakita sila na in that, that kind of ano uh, sa mga ganyang case, nagugulat sila. May narinig ako one time, sabi niya, uy, na, may, may ano, o, oh, baliw siguro yan, yung ganun. Binal, alam niyo, binalikan ko, sabi ko, alam niyo ba, ano yan, disability yan, sabi ko. Hindi na, walang may gusto ng ganyan, pero dapat sana inuunawan ninyo, inaalam ninyo. Instead na, instead na sinabi niyo na baliw yan, sana nilapitan niyo, ma'am, ano po maitutulong namin, uh, pwede po bang malaman, ano yung case ninyo? Kasi matututo tayo may sa pagtatanong. So, hindi yes. sana, hindi dapat ganun na minamaliit natin yung tao, dinidiscriminate natin. At the way we talk, ay binubuli natin yung tao. Nakakasakit tayo ng damdamin. Alam nyo, nung binalikan ko, yung napahiya sila. Kinausap ko sila ng maayos. Then, in-explain ko kung ano yung, alam, alam nyo ba kung sino yung sinasabihan nyo ng ganyan. Hindi, ano yan, uh, disability yan, at hindi niya kontrol ang sarili niya. Kung kayo ang nasa sitwasyon niya, gusto niyo sabihin kayo ng ganyan, alam mo sagot nila, sorry ma'am, hindi po namin alam. Kaya nga sinasabihan ko kayo kasi hindi mo alam. Dapat ang the best way natin ginawa ninyo is nilapitan ninyo, 
nagtanong kayo ano ba maitutulong ninyo or tanungin ninyo ma'am, pwede po bang malaman kung ano yung case ninyo? Kasi kami aware kami sa ganyan eh. Di ba Chris, no? aware tayo sa ganyan na mas mas natutuwa tayo pag nagtatanong sila sa atin. So yung dapat dapat ganoon. Oo. Oo. Kasi ulit na. Oo. Na nang iinsulto sila ng persons with disability kasi di ba Mommy Glosser Romel, meron tayong uh, law dito, yung RA 9442, yung yes. the Magna Carta for Disabled uh, yes. Persons, so, oh, 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 the Rights and Privileges. Mm-hmm. So when someone yes. ridicules you, ininsulto ka, pwede kasi silang maano, di ba? Kaya Correct. This is for inform for the information may, uh, uh, for everyone na uh, Yes, uh, may, may patas na tayo diyan. Mm-hmm. Oo. Yes. Pwede silang okay. ano, makakuhan, may penalty, parang gano'n. So, yes. yes. And speaking of which, yung mga right natin, makikita natin yan in just a short while. Ano. And uh, Chris, yes. uh, stay. Oh, mag-stay ka lang. Because we have another question for you which will be uh, given to you by uh, Ma'am Feli. Pero bago pa ang ating question na yan, alamin muna natin yung sinasabi ni Ma'am Feli about the rights yes. of PWD. With this commercial Educate break, we'll be right back. back. <laughs> yes, we'll be right back. Don't go away. Yes, stay there. Under Philippine law, every person with disability is guaranteed rights to access and opportunities in pursuit of equality. Here are the rights of the PWD. One, employment. Every PWD shall enjoy equal opportunities in the workplace and maintain the right to pursue any employment that they're qualified for. 2. Education PWDs from all parts of the country shall have the same access to quality education and educational assistance. The government also pledges to establish, maintain, and support a complete special education system in all schools across the nation. 3. Health The Department of Health has pledged to establish and pursue a nationwide health program for the prevention, recognition, early diagnosis, and early rehabilitation of disability. 4. Auxiliary Social Services The Philippine government shall ensure that all PWDs will have access to auxiliary social services like social enhancement, daycare, and family care services that will help restore their function and participation in community affairs. 5. Telecommunications Communication services such as those through the broadcast media and various means of information dissemination will provide sign language and or closed captioning in their programs to ensure that all differently abled citizens will have access to the same information at the same time as the rest of the nation. 6. Accessibility All public and private spaces including modes of transportation, shall follow and maintain accessibility provisions to ensure a barrier-free environment for all PWDs. 7. Political and Civil Rights The state ensures that all PWDs shall maintain the right to vote and assemble. 8. 20% discount and exemption from the value-added tax all PWDs are entitled to a 20% discount and VAT exemptions on lodging, food, recreation, medicine and medical services, transportation, and funerary services. And there you go. Uh, that is actually the content of RA 9442, ano? Yung ano natin. Yes, RA 9442. Pinag-uusapan natin. Uh, yun ang provision niya, no? Nung no, no, batas, no? Kaya sinasabi natin dito, besides that, no? Talagang merong, uh, meron ding nakalaan sa batas na yan uh, na kapag tayo ay uh, 
Ah, uh, ridicule, no, ng uh, kahit na sino, no, no? at uh, minamak mm-hmm. tayo, minamalikay so because of our appearance as a person with disability or discriminate tayo because of our appearance, ano, ay meron po tayong tinatawag na pwedeng kasuhan diyan, ano. Pwedeng kasuhan natin ng vilification niyan, ano, uh, under that law, yes, no, may may ano yan. May multa yeah. yan at saka may kulong. Yes. Kaya, so, yun. kaya wag ko so, yun na experience natin <laughs> kay Chris, ano. Oh, si Chris Ay, talagang na experience niya, niya no? Oo. Oh. So, Ay, yan mo Chris kapag kapag inapi ka, tawagin mo lang si Attorney Romel Arellano Char. Yeah. Yes. Kahit na saan ka, kahit na saan pupuntahan kita. <laughs> yes. Okay, so we have a question for you. Ma'am Feli, can you uh, do the, the honor of uh, giving her the uh, next question? So, ito, Chris, uh, the last question, but of course not the least, is a very important question. So, what is your message to all people with cerebral palsy? Um, message ko lang sa lahat ng mga kagaya po with cerebral palsy. Um, huwag kayong mahigiyang lumabas. Huwag kayong mahigiyang sabihin yung mga gusto niya sabihin, kasi tao lang po tayo eh. May kamasalan dahil po tao tayo. Um, huwag din kayo mahiyang, huwag kayong matakot na mag-aral. Bahala niyo yung mga bullies. At ang um, importante, huwag kayong mag-aral tayo. Kasi yun lang yung may magmamalaki natin in spite of our disabilities eh. Na kahit meron tayong ganito, kaya natin magkabagsabayin sa kanila. Um, may sasabihin sana ako sa mga magulaw okay okay lang po go ahead, go ahead. yes go ahead yes go ahead go ahead um, para po sa mga parents na may anak na may cerebral palsy um, sana po huwag nung pagkait sa kanila yung pagkakataon na makapag-aral na maging normal kasi po, yun lang po yung isa sa mga um, may pagmamalaki namin eh. Yung nakapag-aral kami. Um, sana rin po, taasan niyo yung pasindya sa amin kasi yung mga times talaga na hindi na makontrol yung mga galaw namin. Kailangan namin ng tulong palagi. So, kunting tiyagal lang po. Tsaka, sa pamilya po, Um, huwag nyo na po kong gawin. Katatawanan nyo. Huwag alam namin. Huwag sasalita namin kasi kahit joke lang po yun sa inyo. Masakit po yun sa amin eh. Kasi um, galing po yun sa inyo pamilya, pamilya namin. Pinagtatawan po po kami. Imbis na pinaprotektahan nyo kami. Kami pa yung, kami pa yung unan nung magbulit namin sa sana. Sa pamilya, especially sa parents, huwag pong gawin katatawanan yung ano. Huwag po kayong pamayag na gawin katatawanan yung anak nyo sa harap ng pamilya nyo. At saka, last day po, sa lahat ng pagkaya ko, huwag po laban lang. Huwag tayong matakot na ipahayag yung mga gusto natin. Kahit pinagtatawanan tayo, laban lang po. Yan lang po. Thank you. Wow. Oh, totoo yun. Napakaganda oh, ng sinabi. Ang dilaw ng message. Parang call out sa sa lahat, di ba? Not only sa ano. Pero lalo na, lalo na yung family yes, naman. Yes, sa lahat. Lalong lalo na. Mm-hmm. Lalo na sa pamilya, sa mga parents. So, mm, tumagos talaga kasi, sa akin. Kasi alam mo, uh, yes. Actually, tumutuloy luha ako. Ang number one kasi, sa atin mga person, nayak, nayak ako ha, sa ating mga person with disability, ang number one na inaasahan natin at magiging kakampi natin ay ang pamilya natin. Yes. Kung ang pamilya natin mismo ang magdidiscriminate sa atin at mambubuli sa atin, sino pa ang tatanggap sa atin sa labas kung sa loob ng bahay hindi tayo matanggap ng buo? Paano yes. tayo mabubuo sa labas kung sa loob ay hindi tayo buo? 
at paano tayo magkakaroon ng magandang kinabukasan at tibay ng ano ay maka, maka, maka magkaroon tayo ng lakas ng loob na humarap sa ibang tao kung ang kung ang magulang natin ay itinatago at ayaw tayong ipakita sa mat, sa madadal na kakahiya daw naranasan ko yan yes, noon po. pero hindi noong noong ako ay nat, na nagkaedad na Inilabas ko yung sarili ko. Tinanggap ko ko ano yung mga diskriminasyon, mga bullies na naririnig ko. Tinanggap ko lahat yun. At ito yung naging tool upang magkaroon ako ng strong determination. Kaya sabi ko, kung kaya nila, kaya ko. So tayo na mga, mga person with disabilities, kailangan marun matuto tayo. Kailangan magkaroon talaga tayo ng, ng, ano, ng sariling pangarap at pananaw sa buhay na ang lahat ng bagay ay kaya natin gawin. Kasi meron tayong Panginoon na gumagabay sa atin. God, God allow things to happen for a reason and for a great purpose. Kaya kung ano man yung estado ng condition na meron tayo ngayon, andyan ang Panginoon para tulungan tayo. At sa mga taong dumatanggap at, na, at nananan, naniniwala sa atin, sila'y magiging gabay natin upang ang mga minimiti natin pangarap ay makamtan natin pagdating na araw. So, Chris, sa istorya na, ipina, na ipinamalas mo ngayong gabi, ang dami. Ako man, no? Ako man na, na naging wake up call sa akin ito na, Feli, Sir Romel, hindi, dito, hindi, dito natatapos ang ating, ang ating, ano, ang ating purpose pa buhay. At yung pag ano yung advocacy bilang isang advocate no bilang isang advocate hindi natatapos sa mga ganitong usapan lang sa lahat ng dako saan man tayo naroroon kailangan mai maipakita natin at mai mapatunayan natin na ang mga person with disability ay may, may kakayahan na hindi lamang dapat isinasantabi na wag ka nang lumabas kasi nahirapan kang maglakad wag ka nang lumabas kasi wag ka nang mag-aral kasi wala kang magagandang kinabukasan hindi po lahat tayo ay pantay-pantay may marami tayong may mga pangarap tayo na dapat nating ma ma marating at may mga ga gusto nating gawin na dapat nating tapos. So yan lamang po, maraming maraming salamat. Chris, pinayak mo ko. Hello. <laughs> grabe, grabe talaga ang ano, ang ang grabe ang motivation sa gabing ito na alam ko hindi lamang tayo mga host ang ang na-inspired na motivate lahat ng mga viewers natin sa buong na nakikinig oh, sa atin. Yes, at itong oh, itong yes, itong, itong itong live streaming na to, itong link na to, yes. Itong yes, aware na talaga. Itong link na to ay pwede nating i-share anytime pwedeng panoorin kahit sa isang taon pa, pwede pa ring panoorin ito nang kung sino man ang gustong manood at pwede nating i-share Chris ha. Pwede nating i-share kahit kanino ito for education awareness and information no ayan na grabe na amazed naman na ako at talagang naka naka-relate ako ng gusto sa kwento ng buhay ni Chris Mamiglo, thank you so very much Chris uh, very ano gusto ko yung very inspiring kasi gusto ko yung sinabi ni Chris na about education na kailangan talagang mag uh, kung may pagkakataon um mag magpursue yeah. talaga ng ng education uh, to gain independence so we have to yeah. encourage at kapwa nating ano not only for the city pero lahat ng pero lahat ng mga PWDs na uh, to attend college yes. talaga pursue mm -hmm. your hobbies learn new things because with determination and hard work everything is possible de ba so we can live a life very normal just like everyone else so yun on kaya yes. important tayo on Family and also Feli yung sinabi ni yung sinabi ni yes yung sinabi ni yes yung si go ahead yung sinabi ni Chris na yan is para sa lahat kahit sa mga hindi person with disability as long as yes. may pangarap sa buhay for everybody yeah ito nung katayuan sa buhay yes for everybody yes great insights ano uh, Chris we have gained a lot of insights now from your story tonight and uh, with that we'd like to thank you and um, for for my ano, for my uh, last message for you, Chris, I would like to, to let you know that you are beautiful, regardless of what other people will say. I know you have to keep that in mind. You are beautiful. You are beautiful in God's eyes. You know? 
you are beautiful in our eyes. Don't because despite of all the struggles that you are going through, at alam ko hindi madali. No, upon seeing you, talagang ang akin puso na naduduro ganon na I wish I could have helped you. No, from from stop moving and ano. Actually, Chris, even though even despite of your condition, always remember that you are beautiful. You are beautifully and wonderfully made, iba. So don't worry about how you look like. It doesn't matter. What matters is what is inside your heart, okay? And what matters most is that you understand why you are here, and you understand what is your purpose in this world. Wala tayong hindi hindi tayo baliwala. Hindi tayo walang kwenta. Lahat tayo ay may dahilan kung bakit tayo nag-exist dito. And the only thing that we should do is to find out that reason why. Sabi na yung Mark Twain, so there are two uh, kinds of ano, there are two kinds of um, events in our life. The, the 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 event that you were born, okay, the important the important event in your life. One is the uh, the uh, the way uh, the way that you are born, and the second event is the reason you find out why. So we are here, no? We are born for a purpose. For a reason, and for you, Chris, the reason why you are here is to inspire everyone. Sabi nga kung sino pa yung malakas, sabi ng pagnono ano, siyang iba baba. At minsan yung kahinaan natin ay nagpapaalala sa tao sa kahit sino man nakakita sa atin na walang sino man ang maaring magtaas ng kanyang sarili, dahil ang lahat ng nagtataas ay ibinababa, laging ibinababa. Okay? Oh, yun ang message ko sa yung Chris. You are beautiful. You are a wonderful people, uh, individual. I know. So, so wag mo wag ka magworry how you look like, no? Because in our eyes, in the eyes of other people watching tonight, they have seen one of the most beautiful creation that God has ever made in your person. Please. So you know. Yes. Okay. We stay are so strong, proud please. of you. Yes, we are. We're so proud of you. Proud of you. So proud of you and yes. And thank you very Bago much, Pastor Romel Aureliano, wow. for that wonderful message for Chris Esper yeah, very for Trinidad. <laughs> very, yes. very, I know, very well said, Pastor Romel. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, yes, uh, bago tayo magkaiyakan dito, we just want to make it lighter, ano? pero kanina pa kami halos emotional, ano? we... we, we Oh, uh, nice. Mami Joe, good not help her tears. Ano, bumagsak na talaga. No? Sabi ko nga sa tech natin, no, kay Red, sabi ko, Red Booty, wala kaming background music na medyo soft ngayon. Ano, kung di talaga nag-iyakan na kami rito. Kung oh, hindi talaga na. Oo. Oh, oh, Chris, you, really, you have really touched us from within, Chris. No? So talagang na, na, naapektuhan kami. Grabe, nang, nang buhay mo. No? And uh, your struggles and how you overcome those struggles every day talagang... Uh, na challenge kami and indeed naging eye opener sa amin lahat ito. Okay, so Chris, with that, we'd like to honor you by giving you this certificate. Mami Feli, shall we give our honorable guest his her certificate? Okay, so the certificate of appreciation is presented to Chris Esper Trinidad for imparting her valuable insights and story of inspirations to the viewers. And followers during the online show every Friday night, 7 to 8.30 p.m. at the Voice of PWD, Power, Wisdom, and Dynamism, Season 2, via Facebook page and YouTube channel. Given this 29th day of July, 2022, at VG8 Radio, Creative Voices Productions at Makati City, Philippines. Signed, Robinson Tumampos, Program Manager, and Pocholo de Leon Gonzalez, the voice master. Thank you so much, Chris, and congratulations. Thank you, Chris. Congratulations. congratulations. Yeah, we are so proud of you. Always remember you're so beautiful, smart, intelligent, everything. Yes. Yes, Chris, and continue who you are, okay? The story in your head, put it in writing. You know, sabi nga, put it in writing. <laughs> Oh, yes, create are, more. Uh, create more yeah, stories yeah. to be uh, an inspiration, Chris, motivation, and encouragement uh, to everybody. There are two there are two legacies now that we can do in our life, Chris. Number one is write a book. Number two, plant a tree. So no, so yun daw yung mga legacy na pwede nating uh, maiwan dito sa mundo. Yes. So continue, Chris. 
stay strong always, no? And thank you very much for gracing our show. Wag kang aalis. We'll see you in the background, ano? At uh, magi picture taking pa tayo later on. So yeah, congratulations, so on later. thank you. Okay, stay with us, please. Thank you, Chris. Okay. Congratulations. Thank you. Uh, all right. And I think Sir Romero okay. is yeah. so there uh, acknowledgement. <laughs> yes, oh, there you go. So thank you so yeah. much once again sa ating uh, guest, uh, Chris. And we'd like to thank everybody who is watching tonight, no? all around the world. Sabi nga ni Mamiglo, 